friends, it's Piper and I have a little bit of a different kind of video today. So I've done a handful of costume reviews before, but this is the first time I've actually got the chance to collab with a costume website. So the website that I am collabing with today is costdaddy.com. You can also find them at costdaddy underscore costume on Instagram. We'll have all the links to their website and social medias in the description so you guys can easily find them. But anyway, so costdaddy reached out to me and I also really like the name of that website. I feel like every other costume website has like a really generic name but like no they are daddy which is a great way to never forget this website anyway so they reached out to me and asked if i wanted to collab with them i said i did they sent me a few links of costumes i would maybe want to try on i mentioned that a lot of you guys are really into anime my hair academia and then they asked if i wanted to review their uraka costumes so here we are i thought it would be a bit of a waste to just do this in my bedroom so Corliss and I are about to go out and do an actual photo shoot so you guys can see how this looks in the light and how it looks when I'm actually moving around in it but I'm just gonna give like the talking rundown since I don't know how much of like me actually talking we'll be able to do while we're out and about so starters I'm really happy with this on the website this is $45 and I can understand why because it's very comfortable and breathable which usually you don't really find with bodysuits I've had a handful that are itchy or just makes it really easy to sweat but this is comfortable it's cool on the skin and it's stretchy so I feel like I can do all the poses I'm gonna do later. There's a plane so I'm gonna pause. Well, I'm gonna pass over my house, I don't know why. I'm gonna move the camera angle so you can see a bit, a little bit more of it. As you can see, it didn't come with the accessories. There are two different versions that they sell. One has the like, um, wrists and belt printed on. I got the one without, cause one, cause it's the one they offered, and two, because I feel like this is the best option for if you want to make your own accessories. When I do the photo shoot, I'm going to have some shots with with my wrists and belt on and some without so you can really see like the full quality of this. Yeah, again, it also doesn't have the boots, which worked for me because at some point I'd like to have my own boots. I don't have them yet. So the print goes around the whole thing. It might look a little bit wrinkly and that's because I got a size large because I am... How do I phrase this in a way that um, monetization will not hate me? Um, I have boobs. So I tend to measurement wise for like hips and fit more of a large while I'm also short. So this costume is a little bit longer than um, I am, which is fine because it's not really wrinkling that much. and. I would rather it be a little bit more like stretchy and able to fit my finger than um, the right length but not the right width. That being said, it is very stretchy. I feel like if I was even bigger, I wouldn't have a problem with this. The colors are really nice. I think you guys will get a better idea when I show that in the sunlight. I like that it has like the sun shine and like printed onto it. I know some people might find this tacky but because of how well it is printed and how well you can still see the design of the fabric and it looks like I'm moving or like shining. I really like it. I know I usually suggest that people instead of buying costumes make their own. I'm not saying that my like view on that is completely flipped just because they wanted to collab with me but I also do like to do a combination of the two. This is a nice costume for if you don't want to make a full body suit which I probably wasn't going to be able to do for Uraka anytime soon. So this is a nice way for me to be able to do cosplay this, still get to make some of my stuff, and um, have it be comfortable and high quality. I do think this is high quality, especially if you're not going to be able to have the time to make your costume before a con, for Halloween, or just for yourself. Not everyone wants to make everything, and that's fine. Again, you want to do what makes you happy with costumes. I might actually wear this to a con just because of how much I like it. I was unsure initially when I decided to collab with them, but now that I have it and have it on, I really like the way I look in it. I feel hot. I feel um, like I look like the character, which is kind of a first for Uraka. I feel like she's the most I feel uncomfortable as of the My Hero Academia characters, but right now I really feel like I look like her. Um, yeah, so I'm going to cut to the f shots of me in it.
So thank you guys for watching this video. Hopefully it was helpful that if you guys are looking for this costume in particular or just looking for a site that you can get reasonably priced good costumes from, um, I would recommend these guys. I'd love to collab with Cost Daddy again. Thanks again for reaching out to me and suggesting this. I honestly thought I was going to have to wait till I went up with a lot more subscribers before I got the chance to do something like this, so this was a big deal for me, and having this costume is a big deal for me. We're gonna go out and do a, like, legit shoot, so that's gonna be cool. Um, yeah. So once again, the links are below. I'll probably have the website, like, on screen as well, but if you guys, instead of, like, typing it in and want to just click on a link, I'll have the link to this particular costume as well as the site in general. They have a very large selection of different anime, TV shows, all kinds of stuff, so check them out. If you go to their Instagram, they've collabed with a lot of other cosplayers, so it's not just me that's being like, hey, this is a good place. There's a lot of other people you can check out and see or and get, you know, a second opinion on whether or not you should buy this or not. Um, yeah, that is all. I'm gonna go film a gay skit in this costume. I think you can, you can see, you can see us. In the oh. in the reflection. Oh no 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 no! This is harder than one would think. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, include that in your vlog.